Welcome to this uh, Windows and Computer channel and we're going to talk a little bit about something that I get requests regularly of people mentioning that they have an error, a smart error message. Sometimes in Windows or sometimes it even just when the computer boots up. And a lot of you don't really know what it means and what is actually smart. So every computer has a hard drive and the hard drive could be an SSD solid state drive it could be a mechanical hard drive uh, some have hybrids PCs that have both in the same machine our drives have implemented a system of verification called smart the um, system the way it works is that it actually counts how many read write errors there are every time the drive is uh, doing some you know file access and so on by doing this it actually can check out the status of the hard drive usually a hard drive that works well has you know a certain percentage of errors every hard drive makes errors when reading or writing and that is just because of the way that the nature of how they are built it's not a perfect technology but these errors need to be extremely low and there's part of the drive that also can remove um, defective uh, places on the drive so a, hard, a mechanical hard drive will you know look at uh, maybe a one uh, place on the hard drive where there's uh, data and it's going to say, well, that sector is not reading or not writing well. Let's add that to the table of problems on the hard drive. Over time, the hard drive will have an increased table of sector failures. And that is okay. It's you know the normal part of aging. And as long as it still works well everywhere else, the hard drive just flags it as okay don't use that that spot it's no good same for an ssd when the single state drives solid state drives sorry are also um, looking at the status of each cell of memory and if something is wrong with one it'll just flag it as unusable and add it to the list of places not to write data of course that also means that over time a hard drive might have slightly less total capacity because of the status of some of the cells or sectors that are bad now when that accelerates if that the number of uh, you know SSD cells or the number of regular hard drive sectors start to skyrocket in defectiveness the smart status knows that and what happens is the drive will flag an error message also another thing that can happen is not that the drive cells or the uh, sectors are bad necessarily but something maybe the you know read write head or something on the ssd drive that's not right is suddenly making much higher rates of errors this will also flag a smart error so when you see that on a machine well the first reflex the first thing you should do is back up all the important stuff because a smart status error is never good it means that the drive is probably starting to fail and that someday you'll turn on the PC and it just won't work anymore in the most extreme cases well you could have a smart error that prevents your PC from booting this is also you're already in a very bad situation when that happens and of course, at the most extreme, what happens? Your PC boots up and says there's no hard drive on the uh, system. That's the worst case scenario and probably the one where recovery is going to be difficult and very costly if it's important. That's why you need to back up all the time. Even if you don't have a smart error, back up. It's very important to do so. And the hard drive can fail at any moment. And that means you could lose everything that you have. And you know that the smart, there's, it's cool to have a smart status and, you know, 
have some drives tell you in advance that it's going to fail. But in my tech years, I can tell you that most of the time, there's no warning. Most of the time, you boot up, nothing happens. The drive's already dead. So that also means it's important to back up all the time. I am still very... Uh, I would I would say it disturbs me to see so many people here on the channel say, "Should I back up my files?" It's not even a question of should you. Everybody, everybody, should back up all the time. It's a minimum of using a computer. Um, it's it's funny how people think that it's not something that you have to do, and that you know I keep all of my files there, and it should be okay. And remember that a backup is data in two different places. It's a copy in another spot. Don't do like a lot of people do. They take the, the, the files, they put it in an external hard drive and think that's a backup. A backup is not one space. It's multiple places because if one fails, you have the backup. Uh, one hard drive can fail and you lose everything. But two hard drives at the same time or, or you know a hard drive in the cloud you're really out of luck if both of them actually fell at the same time. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.